Awesome, you have one-to-one -one coaching clients, you don't know how to manage them. But let me show you how you can do exactly that with just one software called Kajabi. When you acquire a new coaching client, usually you agree for some one-to-one -one sessions, maybe a specific number of sessions. And you also want to give them pre-recorded materials for them to study in their own time. And also you want to give them tools and resources that they can use as they get coached by you. Let's jump into Kajabi so I can show you what is going to happen when you acquire new coaching clients, what's going to look like for you, how you can set it up and what your client's experience will be as well. Let's do it. Here we are inside Kajabi, the product tab. And what we want to do if you want to start coaching is create a new product. So let's click on new product. And in this case, we're going to be looking at the coaching product. Immediately, you can see that you've got available features live video conferencing. If you want to avoid using Zoom, you can use Kajabi for that as well. You've got calendar integrations. If you've got Calendly to book appointments with you, you can upload video content, audio content. You can share notes. You've got files and tools that you can have them accessible as downloads. And also you can have one-to-one -one coaching as well as group coaching. But for this video, we're going to look at the one-to-one -one coaching for now. Let's click get started and let's give the title. Let's call it one-to-one -one coaching, coach name, description, Scale to 10K a month. If you have a thumbnail, you can upload a thumbnail. I don't have one right now, so click on continue. Here's where you can decide whether you want to do one-to-one -one coaching or group coaching. Let's select one-to-one -one coaching. And here is gonna ask you how many sessions you've got set up for them. And let's say we have 10 sessions. Don't worry, you don't have to set up this number precisely right now. You can add ad hoc sessions if you find you need more. So let's click continue. Here's where you choose whether you wanna use your Calendly integration and it's something that you can do in the Kajabi settings integrations, which I don't think I've done right now. You can use a custom link if you want to use your, for example, your Calendly link as it is. You can use this option. You can use manual booking, whether you decide to book it via messenger or keep it free without having to use an interface to book a session with you. Or you can use the Kajabi scheduler. In this case, I want to use my Kajabi link as it is just to avoid confusion so I can send that link to my client whenever I want and I use that. The custom URL is, for now, this is my custom URL, continue. And here we can already choose kind of colors the product is going to have. I'm gonna go for my usual blue and yellow, continue. Kajabi is gonna ask you to create an offer around this already, unless you wanna do it later. Since we are here, why not? Let's do it. Let's say that for 10 sessions, I'm gonna have a $10,000 and I wanna use Stripe only. Actually, it's not a one-time offer. Let's say it's a multi-payment of $1,000 for 10 months. There you go. This is gonna create a checkout, an offer inside Kajabi as well as the product. All of these pages, automations, email sequences, they've all been set up within Kajabi, which is the software that we use to run all of our online businesses. If you wanna start building your email funnel in Kajabi, which is the software that we use to run everything, I can give you double the amount of free trial if you use the link in the description box below. Not only are you gonna get double the trial, which is 30 days, but we're gonna give you a jump start kit, which is a mini course for you to set up your Kajabi account perfectly from the get go. We're gonna give you a sales page template you can use to start writing your sales pages. And if you decide to stick with Kajabi for more than 30 days, we also give you sales page templates that you can drag and drop into your account and have a beautifully designed sales page that you can fill up with the copy that you've written using our guide. You wanna start right now? Link in the description. But here we are inside the product. Of course, there's nothing here, but what you can do is to go into package outline. This is where you can change the name of the sessions. And if you have a specific path where you take your clients through the same journey, you already know what the sessions are gonna be like. And here you can change them in terms of title and in terms of what description is better representing the session specifically. You can add items of the agenda, for example, marketing research, wanna do assessment of of present assets, offer overview, or anything that you wanna go through in the first sessions. You can add resources. In this case, you can add either a link or a file already. And once you're done, you click save. This is where all of your clients will show up, all of the names. And it doesn't matter how many one-to-one -one clients you have, you're only gonna be using one Kajabi product. Even if you are on the basic package of Kajabi, which only allows a few products, this is the only one you need if you just wanna do coaching. As you can see, if I go into the sales offers tab, I 
can see that there is a new offer in there. If I click on it, what I will see is that the Kajabi coaching product has already been added to the list of accessible products after somebody paid for it. I can, in this case, add additional resources like a mini course. For example, I want to give these people access to my offer launch product, as well as I want to give them a Kajabi starter kit, which is what we give to our affiliates to set up their Kajabi account from the ground up. Maybe I want to give them a course as a bonus because they've paid a one-off and uh, I want to reward them. Okay, so every time somebody buys this offer, they will receive all of this stuff immediately. But now let's have a look at what your clients will see on their front facing interface. When somebody pay for your coaching products, they're going to get access to their dashboard. And within the product list, there'll be a one-to-one -one coaching, which is the one that we just created. And if they click on it, here's what they're going to look like. The interface is going to be like that. It's going to reveal the name of the product and what's included in it, your name, and also how to schedule the sessions. So by themselves, they can already schedule a session with you. For example, session one is going to go through all of this stuff. You can click on schedule now and it's going to bring them to the link that you've provided Kajabi with. In this case is a Calendly link. Otherwise you could use the Kajabi scheduler or anything that it's available within Kajabi. As you can see, the interface is nice and beautiful and they can always access the recording of the sessions as well. In fact, every time you finish the session, you can upload it inside the backend. Let me show you how it looks like when you've finished the session and you've uploaded all of the recordings, the notes and the resources that your clients need. We are inside one of our client sessions and as you can see, I've copied and pasted all of the notes that we took with the timestamp or where this has been addressed. I've used an AI app called Fathom. I'm gonna link it in the description box below in case you want it. It's very cool. As well as uploading the video of the session itself so that the client can view it whenever they want. If you wanted to add resources like we did in different sessions, you can do it here by clicking on resources and upload more resources. In this case, this is a PDF and these are a couple of uh, links to Google Docs that they can copy in their own Google Drive. Isn't it amazing how we can easily set up something and give a top class experience to our one-to-one -one coaching clients? But maybe you don't have clients right now and it might be that your social media content is not enough to attract the right type of people. Of course, we all need to know the strategies and the how to's, but something way more important is to share our why, our values and our experience. And the way we found our why, I had to do a video to explain how important there is. And if you want to watch it to find your own voice in marketing and sales and social media, this is the video where I share how I found mine.